how to enjoy losing weight. Is that even possible? Hello and welcome, my name is Blaine and in today's video I'm going to give you five simple steps on how you can lose weight and actually enjoy yourself in the process. By the way, if you're new to the channel, press on the subscribe button, it will change it from red to grey and it will also show you when I bring out a brand new video. So one of the first things I ever did to lose weight and actually enjoy it was making a challenge out of what I was doing. I used to try and challenge myself on how much I could do just from doing push-ups, sit-ups, anything ups really as much as I possibly could in just in a certain amount of time or just in all in one go as many as I could possibly do and this helped me almost just take the feeling away that I was actually exercising so instead of just thinking oh I'm actually exercising now it's like you know what bash out as much push-ups as I can let's go Bam. didn't even think about it you just do it but you're actually exercising what you're actually doing so a great way to do that number one is to create challenges for yourself your own challenges it doesn't matter what they are as long as you do them as well of course a second step that made it a lot easier for me to enjoy it is involve either a friend or a kind of a community around what you're you're trying to do and achieve how, how does that help it basically gives a little bit of commitment to the people that you're surrounding yourself with and actually get what you're trying to do done so say if you're doing it with a friend you two will keep yourselves accountable when say one doesn't really want to do it and the other one will just say hey look we're going to do it anyway and in the long run it always helps push up the bar and it also creates competition against each other as well you're just trying to compete with a friend you know it's 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 a healthy competition now say if you haven't got any friends that are interested in doing that then you can go on communities online and stuff like that where you can actually see workouts they're doing or videos they're doing and competing with each other like that and you can post yours and see and it, this will keep you also a little bit more accountable with yourself sharing with others. Comment down below if this is making sense and if you want to try any of these. My third point would be to have a plan. So this helps you out to know what you're doing, how far you actually come and if, you, if anything's actually happened at all in whatever you're trying to achieve. If you're trying to lose weight, gain weight, um, gain muscle, whatever you're trying to do. If you're trying to run further with a plan, you'll see what you've actually done, how to get what you've, you've got already, or if you're actually going to progress at all. Because honestly, the main driver for, to enjoy it is actually seeing process. And if you're not, if you don't measure it with a plan, then you'll, you'll just get discouraged and you'll just be like, well, what's the point anyway? So my fourth tip is make sure you celebrate small wins. Why is that important? So it's basically, if you don't celebrate the small things that you actually achieve on the way, you're just waiting for one big thing to happen. Say if you're just trying to hit, lose 10 pounds or something like that, you will never celebrate throughout. If you keep celebrating at two pounds, four pounds, six pounds, eight pounds, it will really encourage you to keep going to hit that big milestone. In terms of celebrations, you know, it's just telling people what you're actually doing. It makes you feel good. And then people actually encourage you as well, push you on. And these little celebrations, that's what's important. It's the process that you have to enjoy to lose the 10 pounds, not just once you hit 10 pounds, then you're happy. It's not how it works. Whatever your target is, just make sure you break it down into small steps and actually celebrate those steps as you go along. And the last tip, number five, which will help out a huge chunk is to learn and progress in whatever you're trying to get to. So say if you're trying to lose 10 pounds, like we were saying before, learn about all the best ways to do that and things that you should try and things that you think will actually work for yourself. What you have to do is literally uh, put it in online. Oh, best way to lose 10 pounds, learn how to run a marathon, best ways to get really big and muscly. Something like that. Easy ways to just find out really good practices and just immerse yourself in learning what you're trying to achieve because if you're just going out blind, nine times out of 10, you're probably gonna walk into a wall, all right? A lot more times than say, if you had your eyes open, you know what you're trying to do with a plan, you're doing it with someone by your side and um, you're creating challenges left, right and center. And every time you do a challenge, you're celebrating together with small wins and you keep learning and learning and learning it will, it will become really enjoyable for both of you or just yourself with the community you're learning with. And trust me, it will make it so much easier than just going, how do I lose weight? You try something, don't really enjoy it. Can't be bothered to really do it. Just kind of one foot in, one foot out. You have to jump in with two feet, okay? 
So those are the five things that I used for myself that actually really helped me enjoy my fitness journey, which I mean, I'm still enjoying it now and I'm seven years in, been a long time and I still find ways to try and enjoy it. But those are my five best tips that I can possibly give to someone. If you still haven't tried changing the color of the subscription button below, press it, it will turn gray. And also it'll show you my latest videos that I'll be doing for you. If there's any videos you want me to do, then comment below. I'm more than happy to do a video on that subject. However, that is it from me from today. See you guys soon. Peace.